What's good, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Black Ice coming at you with another unboxing and review. Continuing with the Good Smile Company Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle line, we have Michelangelo. Now, this actually might be my favorite Ninja Turtle from this line. At first, I thought it was Dunny, but this may take the cake. So, I'm very excited to check this one out. Uh, now, this is the fourth turtle from the line, so we will be showing the display here at the end. And then we also have Shredder for our building line, and then we'll be showing that display once we do that unboxing and review. If you have been enjoying these videos, make sure that y'all hitting that like button and subscribing to the channel. I do appreciate everybody who has been supporting the channel. We are almost on our way to 2,000 subs, and I truly appreciate that. But yes, man, let's go ahead and jump into this unboxing and check out this statue. All right, so here we go. We got Michelangelo. We have his nunchucks. We have look like some cables, and we have his base. All right, so here we are with the base. Uh, continuing with that same theme uh, from the rest of the Ninja Turtles, uh, we have that nice concrete style base uh, with the different pipes uh, and the different cracks and textures uh, throughout it. Uh, as you can see on the top, it has like a little bit of rubble uh, where the concrete is kind of broken up. And um, we have a little rebar coming out the bottom as well. So I really do like this base. Uh, it has a lot of nice details to it. And uh, yeah, looks good. All right, so first we'll peg in this bundle of cables. And then we'll peg in Michelangelo. All right, and then next we'll peg the uh, arm in, uh, which is holding the nunchucks, and then we'll slide that through the other hand as well. All right, man, check this out. He looks amazing. So first off, man, I'm loving the way that the tail on the bandana flows underneath the nunchuck. Uh, the way that it's flowing in the wind just looks amazing. And then we have a pair of nunchucks here on his back, on his belt, and that looks dope. And then similar to the other statues, man, the, the different scrapes and cuts that he has, uh, you can tell that he's really just been out there fighting, man. And then on the lower half here, just more of that amazing detail with the knee pads and the different wraps around his ankles and his shin. Just looks real good. And I do think they did an incredible job with all the statues from this line thus far. Uh, but yes, man, Mikey definitely takes the cake for me. Uh, I'm really feeling this statue. All right, and now taking a look at Mikey in full view. Wow, really does look great. Uh, his pose is kind of similar to Ralph. Uh, it seemed like they're just going in the opposite direction. But with the nunchucks, man, he really does look amazing, and I'm digging this pose. Now, let's go ahead and check out Mikey along with his brothers inside the display. All right, so this is our turtle side of our display, uh, separated from the villains, and wow. So I really decided to, you know, embrace the art of James Jean here, you know what I'm saying? So I really wanted to uh, showcase the art print uh, as well as the turtles and really just bring that vision to life. Um, so that's the reason uh, that I decided to create this type of display uh, for the turtles. And, uh, and I think it came out amazing. So as you can see, uh, we have all four of the brothers here uh, posed up uh, similar to the art print and um they look amazing now right here on the side uh this is a long version of the art print 
uh, I decided to make one of these. Uh, I actually made these myself. Um, found some art print uh, renders online and uh, made them and I think they came out amazing. Uh, as you can see we have another one here behind the statues as well. Uh, so yeah man like I said I really wanted to embrace the art print uh, by James Jean and uh, I think that I did a great job doing so. Uh, but yeah man just let me know what y'all think. Um, this is half of the display. Uh, obviously uh, we got the uh, villains on the other side so we will showcase those once we do shredder which is our last villain statue uh, but yes man I am really digging this uh, I think it came out amazing and uh, and I'm so excited to uh, finally be able to reveal this to y'all but yes just let me know uh, in the comments below what y'all think about the statues what y'all thought about the line overall uh, make sure that y'all hit that like button if you did like the video and then make sure that you subscribe to the channel if you haven't already Definitely make sure that y'all clicking that notification bell That's the way y'all stay tuned in to all the new videos that I post uh, I do appreciate y'all for supporting the channel uh, like I mentioned earlier and like I said also we're on our way to 2,000 subs so make sure that y'all tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend uh, to support the channel. And uh, yeah, man, we got more videos coming real soon. Until the next time, peace.